So one book of interest that you might like is Forgive Me Leonard Peacock by Matthew Quick. I just finished this one yesterday. Um, it's I saw Matthew Quick speak, I think, at a, a convention in um, Chicago a couple years ago. And I got this book then, and it's kind of been sitting on my shelf. It looked intriguing, but I hadn't really gotten around to it. And um, I had some students come up to me last year and say, oh, you've got to try this. Have you read this book? It's so fantastic. And so I was like, oh, I have it, but I haven't gotten around to it. So I bumped it up on the list since they had recommended it. And sure enough, it was really, really good. Um, it's realistic fiction, and it starts off with Leonard Peacock explaining uh, at the beginning of the story that today is the day that he is going to shoot one of his classmates and then kill himself. Uh, but before he does that, he has four people that he wants to go visit, people who have impacted him in a positive way. And he wants to make sure that they understand that he appreciates what they've done for him before he leaves this world. So... Um, as you go through the story, you see him interact with these different people and you get a feel for what it is he um, has gone through that has brought him to a point where he feels like this is the only thing he can do. And it is a, a very quick read, very engaging. Right away, you love Leonard Peacock because he has this kind of sarcastic um, sense throughout the story. He also uses footnotes to explain lots of the different things that he does. So the formatting itself is an interesting one. Um, if it is, it does have some mature content and there's some foul language there, are, you know, some other kind of situations that are, um, might make people a little bit uncomfortable, but it is a fantastic book and I would definitely recommend it.